So today I'm going to be talking about sacrifice. So sacrifice is pretty much giving up something in return for something even better, but that better thing isn't necessarily going to come right away. So sacrifice usually involves stopping doing something. I don't mean in the sense of like sacrificing a human or anything. I just mean stop doing this particular thing so that you can achieve another thing. So in that sense, it's usually to gain something and it's essentially a transaction. You're sacrificing something for another thing. We do it every day. When we go into a shop, we sacrifice money for goods and services. So it's a transaction and we should really think of it as a transaction because we want to get something better from this sacrifice. And one of the benefits of sacrifice is getting the psychological momentum to get ahead. So if you sacrifice something like money to buy this course, then you're a lot more likely and accountable to actually do this thing or this course because you've already spent a lot of your money on it. So in that sense, sacrifice is a real amplifier of your um, momentum psychologically. So you actually believe that you're in, invested in this thing, therefore you more likely are going to be invested in, in it. So I think that it's a good way to really boost your conviction. And that's another thing. Sacrifice, the amount that you're willing to sacrifice is a measure of your conviction. So if you're not willing to give up anything at all, then you can see how that what that speaks for your conviction. Whereas if you are able to give up a lot of things or give up something really big like gaming then that's if you're an avid gamer then that's a pretty hefty sacrifice and you probably have strong conviction then so it's also a measure of your discipline because if you don't continue with the sacrifice and you don't stay off whenever you need to stay off then you're not going to continue are you so your discipline is put to the test when you're um committing a sacrifice so yeah make sure that you have the discipline and the conviction down before you start sacrificing or s making like big gesture that you're going to sacrifice because that way you're going to just doubt yourself more because if you say you're going to do something you're not going to do it it does affect your head and affects your image of yourself so don't make any self um, condemning proclamations or don't tie yourself down to anything yet just do what you can and when the time comes be brave enough to do it but don't do it too fast don't be reckless but do it eventually so another thing that sacrifice is involving is money and time so as i said before money is the main thing that we sacrifice on a daily basis but it's not really that bad unless it's a lot of money and we kind of need it for something more essential like don't gamble if you need to have dinner tonight just don't get don't gamble your money away that would be not a very worthy sacrifice but if you're sacrificing money for maybe just a bit of money for a donation to a charity or a cause then that is a worthy sacrifice so you can be commended on that but not on frivolous activities. And the other th aspect of this is time. So time is, as we know, our most valuable resource and we need we need more time. If we don't have time, then we're dead. So we need, uh, we need to sacrifice our time wisely and accordingly. So it usually is as easy as it looks on paper. If something doesn't seem wise, then it's probably not. If just, drinking alcohol all night is what you do then that's probably not the best use of your time that you could be using it for so maybe use it for something better we know what's productive we know what we need to be doing we know that we could go to the gym instead and use that as our time it's only four or five percent of your day so use that make sure to make time for your sleep sacrifice enough time for your sleep because your sleep is one of the cornerstones of your health and if you don't have that then your life just goes down abysmally so make sure that you have enough 
sleep a night and you sacrifice enough time to do the things that you need to do uh that way your life will be more fulfilling it'll be more you'll be you'll take yourself more seriously and people will sense that around you and therefore they will take you more seriously as well so make sure you're willing to um sacrifice your time on the things and on the times that need to be sacrificed that it's been happening for many years as well people have been sacrificing their whole days on their jobs and that's so that they can provide them for themselves or their family or friends and that's a worthy endeavor i think now another thing i've seen with sacrifice is the exponential growth that comes with particular time sacrifices so if people sacrifice their whole day to pursue something then that pursuit is going to go very very well if they don't then they can still grow but it won't be as good i'm not talking from experience either i have not yet sacrificed my whole day i've maybe done it a few times but that was just it was because i was in college lectures and they're kind of they kind of waste time anyway let's be honest and the last thing I want to talk about is words because my phone's about to die and we need to decide whether the sacrifice is worthy because if it's not worthy then we're not going to be able to be confident in our decision to sacrifice and therefore we're going to have a half-baked conviction so we want to make sure it's worth it and the, the things that are most worth sacrificing for do sacrifice for them you probably know it deep down so make sure you do that anyway thanks for watching I'll see you in the next one